Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's Mikey Pipes. I got Steven Godzilla next to me. We are on our way to Woodsburg, which is a hamlet on the south shore of Nassau County on Long Island. And if you guys recall, on New Year's Eve, I went on a service call, and I'll briefly tell you, they uh, have no hot water. And what that means is the hot water is cold. All right? Not that no water is coming out of it, just the hot water is cold in all the faucets. Yet the 50 gallon ream brand new water heater is running at 100%. And I posted that New Year's Eve quiz. And uh, it was very interesting to read the comments. <laughs> but I should have given a little more detail. But at the end of the day, they had a slab leak on the domestic hot water line. And the leak was faster than rate of production of hot water. I don't have or didn't have the equipment to locate exactly in the slab where the leak is. And now I do. Why? Because I invest money into my company. That way I have the best tools to get the job done efficiently and effectively. So I uh, called up Leaktronics. They're in um, California. They make this cool stuff that uses sound. And uh, you're going to see me use it. All right. And we're going to get paid. And hopefully the homeowner will have a nice big insurance claim and get a brand new house. <laughs> Not brand new house, but the uh, the slab is the first floor, living room, dining room, kitchen, foyer. It's all the same tile and the tiles from like the 1990s or 1980s. And the kitchen is all resting on the same tile. So chances are he's going to get a brand new kitchen and brand new flooring. So stay tuned. We'll see. Steven will man the phone and I'll show you how we use the Leaktronics device to pinpoint exactly where the leak is. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button, support the channel. If you have done so already, kisses. Mikey Pipes loves you. All right, here's the old water heater that was exhibiting the same exact problem. No hot water, the water's cold. Replace the water heater with this one. And again, same thing, no hot water while it's running. And to buy him some time, because my homeowner also unfortunately got China, I had him close the valve, let the tank heat up, you know, turn that off. And then we need to take a shower, do it quickly, open this up. And again, have it so let's get the electronics out and follow the fleet all right let's start with the laundry room so i already know it's a hot water line mm -hmm. but i am touching the pipe and we can hear the water running I got electronics LT1000. Now, I don't think it's there. It's not inside the wall. We know it's in the slab, but I'm going to go over to the kitchen. And there's our hot water line. And it's much more of a louder sound. I can hear the water and the cold, nothing. Now, I am going to use the sound plate. This just rests on the floor. Mm. And you 
you're gonna move it about eight to 12 inches. Now we have to search the room. We're gonna start by the basement stairs. And I know that the piping goes here to this wall. So we'll start right here. I just want to double check where our pipe comes in. Just did a quick peek. We are one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we're six feet off the stairs for our domestic water lines. Very, very time consuming. Mm -hmm. Closer. Mm -hmm. Wish you guys could hear this. <laughs> we can hear it. We can hear it even like that. No, no, no.
somewhere here. I'm gonna use You're right, it's probably under the gas. Let me get the other one. Turn that valve off. Okay. Yeah, we're right here. Mm -hmm. X marks the spot. Show downstairs. We introduced compressed air at around 12, 15 PSI to the system. And again, this is the easiest way I made it work. And what you're hearing, you're gonna hear the water basically boil. That's what we're hearing. And I could 
be able to hear it, unfortunately, but it sounds like water is boiling <coughs> and it's right here. <coughs> Likely, might be closer to the uh, cabinet. So let's put this back on.